right guys and girls welcome back to the channel and welcome back to uh not a ford vag vag group here we are look we v w um caddy quite a nice one this um so new customer oh you think that's funny didn't you um new customer um from king stainton that's right there isn't it um yeah he contacts us uh contacted us this morning um asking about Revo software upgrades for this one um, it's a two-litre caddy, which is really good, 66 player, and it's like 100, I was under the odd horsepower from stock. I'll just tuck it out now and just in a bit of data log on it, see what it's doing. Um, as I said on a previous video, that's what we do beforehand. Um, and you get real massive gains on these, all right? So uh, what we'll do is we'll insert that and um, we'll prep that up sort of like now. and you'll see the, the gains that you get. Um, yeah, so what we're gonna do is just put a stage one software on it. And yeah, that's it for today on this one. Um, you know, there is uh, other things that you can do on it. Uh, I'm sure he's done lots of things on it, though, you know, with the, the bumper and all that sort of stuff. Um, he's put, have a look, he's put golf bar seats in it as well, which is pretty nice. So as you can see, look, it's got a nice golf bar seats in it. Um, the customary GTI golf ball. Mm -hmm. Just stick cool. ball, yeah. Um, but yeah, I've just been out doing data logging in it with the VCDS. So what we'll do now, look, as you can see up there, look, we're just gonna just check, see what the, as we always do, it'll tell us the uh, whether it needs a superseder file on the ECU, which we'll check now. Um, yeah, and that's about it really. It's quite straightforward on this one. So it's not a particularly long video, it's just a, to let you know what we've got in we'll put all the pictures on instagram and all that sort of stuff and then i'll take it out again but real serious gains on these uh, on the two litre one 1600s the gentleman had a 1600 before not much you can do about them um so but these really really good and so i'll be looking forward to taking this back out and then data logging it again to see what the you know what well, it's, it's big gains it's you know, nearly 100 horsepower so and lots more torque to match so but anyway so um yeah we'll we'll come back and finish up Two months I've done it, and then um, yeah, go from there. See you in a minute. Right, guys and girls, just come back from uh, road test. Um, as you see, the first part was me just showing you with the what we're doing on it with regards to the Revo Stage One. Um, and as I said before, they're a bit, a bit numb, a bit flat, unresponsive um, in this particular spec where it's 100 horsepower. Um, but blimey, doesn't it liven it up putting a Stage One on it? So now it's um, yeah, it's what it should have been really when they. Come out of the factory, it's just you know, lively, so like picks up, gone, um, really talky. Um, there's two um, uh, specifications for file on this. There's just we had to do a, a superseded stock file just to bring it up to date, and then we loaded on the Revo stage one file. There's two one for DSG, one for manual. This is a manual van, five speed manual. So, what that does is the difference in it is it's got reduced torque delivery for the manual, all right? So, we've done that. I've been out in it before, just come back in it again now to make sure everything's all good. Customer's gonna be well happy with it. It's a right transformation. Um, you know, just, just proves to you what can be achieved with these, isn't it, when they're, you know, from stock form, really. Um, but yeah, that's about it. It's only a, qu a, a quick one on this. It's just nice to do something different. You know, we do the VAG stuff now as well as the Ford. Um, but yeah. I mean, it's a lovely looking van, this, you know, he's put all his bits and pieces on it as well. Great color, great wheels. Um, it's got the, the Golf R seats in it. Really, really nice look. You know, we've more than most of the case. There you are, so you can go find that. Um, but yeah, like I said, so um, everything's all done. Um, with regards to the, uh, the VAG stuff, if you own a Caddy, um, then going by what I've just experienced with this, Revo's the way to go. Uh, it's amazing the way it transforms it. Um, and we'll get some feedback from the customer. I'm sure that he's gonna um, you know, have a comment and let me know what's what. Um, and then that's really great to hear, all right? So, but yeah, so Caddy or any VAG car really, as well as the Ford stuff, you know, uh, give us a call. Better to phone me, give us, you know, we can discuss your requirements or, you know, for message, whatever's easy for you really. Um, and then, yeah, you won't be disappointed. But um, yeah, we got a, a few uh, more VAG cars that we're gonna be doing. You know, petrol, diesel, and all that sort of stuff. So we'll we'll show as much as we can, upload um, on the Instagram and the Facebook, and 
of YouTube that we're doing now. So, um, yeah, that's it really. And um, all was to say is uh, we'll see you soon. But before I do that, make sure you hit that bell notification button. Um, subscribe, really important. Little banner will come up, click all, and it'll notify you when uh, we've got a new upload. Um, comments down below, usual thing. And uh, see you soon. Thanks for watching. Bye. Thank <laughs> you.